Yo, what's up guys, it's me, Dark Ranger here, welcome back to another how-to video. This is gonna be a short tutorial video on Photoshop, um, basically how to make transparent borders in Photoshop. Uh, all the Clash Royale YouTubers like do this, transparent borders, not like this. I'm gonna show you the tutorial, for the sake of the, uh, the, sake of the video, I'm using my nickname, kind of playthrough, let's play episode. Five thumbnail. Um, I may have pronounced a bit more uh, agile like that, so sorry about that. But nonetheless, let's go on to the video. This is gonna be a simple tutorial. And by the way, the free series is not finished. I'm gonna upload, but I'm busy, so I'm gonna continue that series on. And for the 100 subscribers special, again, thanks. 100 subscribers. We are now currently at 102 subscribers. Um, I'm gonna plan on doing. Uh, I'm gonna plan on doing. Uh, banner giveaway, um, channel profile picture and banner giveaway. So yeah, now let's go on to the video. So, um, by the way, this is um, I'm just using normal. You need to go to new, then you just need to add. Okay, then drag your file here and drag your photo here, and uh, basically do this stuff. Uh, after doing the border you need to add text so before you see and put text remind that just invisible so you need to don't worry about that so for this sake of the tutorial we what we're trying to do is go to and by the way guys I'm returning on my how do series videos okay so this is why I'm making this video short video but to give you guys updated so what you want to do is on photoshop i'm using photoshop cc 2015 i updated it um a month ago or something it might be that yeah so what you want to do is now click this so you have a new order what you want to do then is um click this paint bucket tool or press g so and place your color at black so this is the code or directly just drag it so you know, not drag, just drag it. And then for my sake of the video, I like to put two layers because it is more. For now, I'm gonna just put one. And how I undo this is Control Z to undo or Control Z, which I already pronounced that. But now it it ain't looking so good. So I'm gonna put another layer. So now it's fine. Then what you want to do is um this is optional if you just want something more great so I'm gonna click on this layer right here then go to brightness and contrast if you don't find that here you just need to scroll everything through I can't for the sake of the video I'm just not gonna do that so you know uh, then I'm gonna just increase don't not increase the brightness but increase the contrast that pops the text out a little bit more so. Once I've gotten this, I think we need to duplicate the layer and put it on top of it. Then what you want to do is, um, if you want to blur it, just go to image or not image, I think it's not rasterize, edit. Um, I haven't used blurring images in a long time. so. Uh, for the sake of the tutorial, now I'm not gonna do that. So, once you have done this, um, you need to click this tool right here. This one. Um, the shortcut is M, the mark UE tool. Then, you need to drag the border you want, you just need to drag it. Um, it can be anywhere, just after dragging it, um, hold, um, release your left click button. As I did right there don't worry about this if you come ac across this no don't worry then what you do is click, uh, backspace just tap backspace like that you tap the backspace and now it has more gridding lines and um, a shadowed effect so don't worry about that this is not your total border you have some work and if you want to remove these um, white and the grids just control D done and you don't need to worry about them just click this and that's done then what 
what I do personally is right click this layer go to blending options then click stroke with stroke will add um, an ugly stroke here that is never ever needed um, what I usually do is if I want to a bit of glass effects on I'm gonna put gradient overlay and if I do you want a total professional border? Just click this. Look, now it looks, now it looks just, just dope. So um, basically, that is how you. Uh, now you can just do that, and it's more like uh, now it's not even visible. So just I'm gonna put that out here. And yeah, guys, that is it for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed, and if you did. Be sit, uh, be cons consider to give it a thumbs up as well, comment down below what you want, and subscribe if you're new to my channel. Check out the links in the description of my social media, follow me on Twitter, and you can DM me any request you want with videos. And yeah, I'm gonna see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye.